There might be once where I saw trace amounts of ketones, but yeah, I can't speak on that experience personally. However, uh, I have seen ridiculously high blood sugars and I can certainly attest to what I've uh, used as a strategy for that. So what I've noticed in my own life is that the higher I get, the more aggressive my correction factor has to be. It's almost like it changes as it gets higher, but then the question becomes correlation versus causation, right? Is it that the high blood sugar is making it more difficult or in requiring more insulin or is it something I did before like a high fat high protein meal that would have gotten even worse had I not doubled up my insulin so was it already going up and going to continue in that direction and I just stalled it or did the high blood sugar itself make me require more insulin so that's always been my thought uh, my question I think dehydration plays a role as well but um, I have had to be a bit more aggressive with corrections once they get past 200.